Pets on Set is brought to you by Sit Means Sit. Welcome back to Good Morning Idaho, everyone. That's right, it's Pets on Set time. We've got Terry with us from the West Valley Humane Society in Caldwell. Good morning, Terry. Good morning. Good for of you for stopping by this morning. Good to see you as always. You too. Okay, we've got a cute one all decked out in pink. This is a real cute one today. Who is this? This is Anna Graham. She's three <laughs> months old. <laughs> she's a Newfoundland mix. Oh, okay. So she's going to be a pretty big girl. She'll be a big one then. Mm -hmm. The newfies, they get huge. But you can see that fur in her. I mean, it's uh, bushy and everything, but she's got some speckles too. You think she might be some kind of uh, shepherd maybe? I'm thinking so. Yeah. Yeah. She looks like she'd be a good runner, one to take on a hike with us good weather too, right? Exactly. <laughs> but she's three months old. So uh, you've got uh, some vaccine clinics coming up too, right? We do. It's today from three to six. Um, we also do microchips at the vaccine clinics, which the weather is getting really warm out, so your dogs are going to want to start running. Yeah. So that way you can get them microchipped as well. So we could find you if they do escape. And that microchip, explain that process, because it might freak people out a little, scare them a little, but it's pretty easy, right? It is pretty easy. It's in a little needle. We put it between their shoulder blades. It takes two seconds to yeah. go in. Um, it, they have a number, and then it's in our computer and registered with 24-hour pet watch as so, well. And if your dog gets loose anywhere, you can go, and if someone finds them, take them to a vet probably, yep. any kind of animal shelter, and they can scan it real easy. Yep, and then call 24-hour pet watch or whatever one that it, the microchips through. Good idea. Very good idea. And I know you mentioned last week um, that now that it's spring and it's getting warmer out, something you have to worry about at the, at the dog parks and anywhere where lots of dogs are is that parvo that's kind of getting around. Yes, that parvo is bad news. So <laughs> is that something that you can just get the vaccine and your dog should be taken care of? Um, you need to do the whole series if your dog's a puppy. Um, and then we recommend you do it once a year. Okay for older dogs. And people who aren't familiar with it, it's very, very dangerous. It is, it's fatal. Um, it's really hard to come back from it when you do have parvo. There's a lot of steps, so it's really expensive to treat as well. Would you say it's easy to contract, easy for the dogs to get it? Very easy. Yeah, um, yeah it comes off your shoes, your clothes, your hands. Um, so easy way to prevent it is make sure you get your dogs definitely. vaccinated for that. All right, and you can always pick up Anagram at the West Valley Humane Society in Caldwell. They are open all the time, so make sure you <laughs> check her out. She's very calm. She's been nice and quiet this whole time, a sweet dog for any home. Thanks so much, Terry. Good to see you again. Thank you, you too. Well,